What's up? Wayne Baron here with DrFakes.net, and we are inside of 3D Studio Max 2013. And uh, from lesson three, we changed our object into an editable mesh. So since we're inside editable mesh, let's go ahead and run through what everything is. A vertex, if you've got a vertex selected, you can barely see them. Little bitty areas along every uh, intersection, so to speak. And so every single time that a line hits another line, you will have a vertex or a vertices, uh, as it's so called. And so each area, that one right there would be at the bottom. So if I come over here and, whoops. Not wanting to move for me. So anyway, if I choose each one of these, then I'm able to manipulate each one of these areas. But we'll get to that later on when I learn how to do it. So uh, next one is edge. The edge is each one of these lines that are between each vertices. And so you can come over here to each one of the edges and do whatever you need to do to each of the edges. And so the next one would be face. Now, as you notice in the faces, uh, we got these triangles. So you're able to manipulate the, uh, the face by extruding it up or down and just having one area. But if you want to do the entire block, you would choose polygon. And polygon will allow you to choose each of these areas. Okay, and then an element, of course, will allow you to select the entire element. So this is lesson number four for how or what everything within the mesh means. Wayne Barron, DarkEffects.net. Y'all have a rocking weekend.